Well, hello there and welcome to another training nugget. In this video, I'll be showing you on how to upload a Loom video into YouTube. So let's get started. If you are a Loom user, you'll understand that anytime you're using Loom as a free version, you do not necessarily have the ability to download the video. But I'll show you how to download that video from the free version and upload it on YouTube. If you have a premium version, it even makes the whole process a little bit easier. So the first thing you want to do is to navigate into your Loom account, my library, and note all the videos that you already have. It could be a video that you've done on yourself or a video that has been shared with a friend to you. So I'll detect any video that I want and in this case I'll use this video for experimenting. I'll navigate into the 3 toggle option and the download option is locked since I'm using a free version. So I'll click on the copy link option, navigate into the internet and look for a free video downloader. In this case, I will use getoff.net. I will click to paste the link to my video and select download. The link will showcase a preview of my video and give me the ability to download it in HD. So I'll click on download and in a few seconds, my video will be downloaded. Once the video is done, I will navigate into YouTube so that I can upload this video. Select YouTube, www.youtube.com, go to the publishing option and select upload a new video. And YouTube will open the YouTube studio for me to upload my video. From the video upload option, I will click on the select or drag and drop which still works the same. I will opt for drag and drop, so I'll navigate into my download option and pick the video I have just downloaded. I will let it to upload and once it's done, I can change the title here into a new video. I can put in the description of the video and any other required pieces within YouTube. I can select where I need it in a playlist. I can upload a thumbnail and all the other processing features are standard on YouTube. Once I feel everything is okay, I'll click on next. I don't want to add any place card, another new next and next. And remember, you can customize this depending on your own preference. I'll click next and my video will start to be visible the moment I click private and save. I will click on the link just to see how it looks like on YouTube. And voila, my Loom video has been uploaded on YouTube. Well, thank you so much for following on this video. If you liked it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you in the next nugget.